Hamburger, Wikipedia Audio A hamburger, beef burger, or burger is a sandwich consisting of one or more cooked patties of ground meat, usually beef, placed inside a sliced bread roll or bun. The patty may be pan-fried, barbecued, or flame-broiled. Hamburgers are often served with cheese, lettuce, tomato, bacon, onion, pickles, or chilies, condiments such as mustard, mayonnaise, ketchup, relish, or special sauce, and are frequently placed on sesame seed buns. A hamburger topped with cheese is called a cheeseburger. The term burger can also be applied to the meat patty on its own, especially in the UK where the term patty is rarely used, or the term can even refer simply to ground beef. The term may be prefixed with the type of meat or meat substitute used, as in turkey burger, bison burger, or veggie burger. Hamburgers are sold at fast food restaurants, diners, and specialty and high-end restaurants. There are many international and regional variations of the hamburger. Etymology and Terminology The term hamburger originally derives from Hamburg, Germany's second largest city. In German, Berg means castle fortified settlement or fortified refuge and is a widespread component of place names. The first element of the name is perhaps from Old High German Hama, referring to a bend in a river, or Middle High German Ham, referring to an enclosed area of pasture land. Hamburger in German is the demonym of Hamburg, similar to Frankfurter and Wiener names for other meat-based foods and demonyms of the cities of Frankfurt and Vienna, respectively. The term burger, a back formation, is associated with many different types of sandwiches, similar to a hamburger, but made of different meats such as buffalo in the buffalo burger, venison, kangaroo, turkey, elk, lamb, or fish like salmon in the salmon burger but even with meatless sandwiches as is the case of the veggie burger. Standard toppings on hamburgers may depend upon location, particularly at restaurants that are not national or regional franchises. Restaurants may offer hamburgers with multiple meat patties. The most common variants are double and triple hamburgers, but California-based burger chain In-N-Out once sold a sandwich with 100 patties called a 100x100, pastrami. Burgers may be served in Salt Lake City, Utah. A patty melt consists of a patty, sautéed onions, and cheese between two slices of rye bread. The sandwich is then buttered and fried. A slider is a very small square hamburger patty sprinkled with diced onions and served on an equally small bun. According to the earliest citations, the name originated aboard U.S. Navy ships, due to the manner in which greasy burgers slid across the galley grill as the ship pitched and rolled. Other versions claim the term slider originated from the hamburgers served by flight line galleys at military airfields, which were so greasy they slid right through you or because their small size allows them to slide right down your throat in one or two bites. In Alberta, Canada a Kubi burger is a hamburger made with a pressed Ukrainian sausage. In Minnesota, a Juicy Lucy is a hamburger having cheese inside the meat patty rather than on top. A piece of cheese is surrounded by raw meat and cooked until it melts, resulting in a molten core of cheese within the patty. This scalding hot cheese tends to gush out at the first bite, so servers frequently instruct customers to let the sandwich cool for a few minutes before consumption. A low-carb burger is a hamburger served without a bun and replaced with large slices of lettuce with mayonnaise or mustard being the sauces primarily used. A ramen burger, invented by Keizo Shimamoto is a hamburger patty sandwiched between two discs of compressed ramen noodles in lieu of a traditional bun.
There have been many claims about the origin of the hamburger, but the origins remain unclear. The popular book The Art of Cookery Made Plain and Easy by Hannah Glass included a recipe in 1758 as Hamburg Sausage, which suggested to serve it roasted with toasted bread under it. A similar snack was also popular in Hamburg by the name Rune Stuck Warm in 1869 or earlier, and supposedly eaten by many emigrants on their way to America, but may have contained roasted beef steak rather than fricadeller. Hamburg steak is reported to have been served between two pieces of bread on the Hamburg America line, which began operations in 1847. Each of these may mark the invention of the hamburger, and explain the name. There is a reference to a Hamburg steak as early as 1884 in the Boston Journal. On July 5, 1896, the Chicago Daily Tribune made a highly specific claim regarding a hamburger sandwich in an article about a sandwich car, a distinguished favorite, only five cents is hamburger steak sandwich, the meat for which is kept ready in small patties and cooked while you wait on the gasoline range. According to Congresswoman Rosa DeLauro, the hamburger, a ground meat patty between two slices of bread, was first created in America in 1900 by Louis Lassen, a Danish immigrant, owner of Louis Lunch in New Haven, Connecticut. There have been rival claims by Charlie Nagreen, Frank and Charles Menches, Oscar Weber Bilby, and Fletcher Davis. White Castle traces the origin of the hamburger to Hamburg, Germany with its invention by Otto Quays. However, it gained national recognition at the 1904 ST. Lewis World's Fair when the New York Tribune referred to the hamburger as the innovation of a food vendor on the pike. No conclusive argument has ever ended the dispute over invention. An article from ABC News sums up, one problem is that there is little written history. Another issue is that the spread of the burger happened largely at the World's Fair, from tiny vendors that came and went in an instant and it is entirely possible that more than one person came up with the idea at the same time in different parts of the country. Louis Lassen of Louis Lunch, a small lunch wagon in New Haven, Connecticut, is said to have sold the first hamburger and steak sandwich in the U.S. in 1900. New York Magazine states that the dish actually had no name until some rowdy sailors from Hamburg named the meat on a bun after themselves years later, noting also that this claim is subject to dispute. A customer ordered a quick hot meal and Lewis was out of steaks. Taking ground beef trimmings, Lewis made a patty and grilled it, putting it between two slices of toast. Some critics like Josh Ozersky, a food editor for New York Magazine, claim that this sandwich was not a hamburger because the bread was toasted. One of the earliest claims comes from Charlie Nagreen, who in 1885 sold a meatball between two slices of bread at the Seymour Fair now sometimes called the Outagamie County Fair. The Seymour Community Historical Society of Seymour, Wisconsin, credits Nagreen, now known as Hamburger Charlie, with the invention. Nagreen was 15 when he was reportedly selling pork sandwiches at the 1885 Seymour Fair, made so customers could eat while walking. The Historical Society explains that Nagreen named the hamburger after the Hamburg steak with which local German immigrants were familiar. According to White Castle, Otto Quays was the inventor of the hamburger. In 1891 he created a beef patty cooked in butter and topped with a fried egg. German sailors would later omit the fried egg.
The family of Oscar Weber Bilby claim the first known hamburger on a bun was served on July 4, 1891 on Grandpa Oscar's farm. The bun was a yeast bun. In 1995, Governor Frank Keating proclaimed that the first true hamburger on a bun was created and consumed in Tulsa, Oklahoma in 1891, calling Tulsa, the real birthplace of the hamburger. History Frank and Charles Menches claim to have sold a ground beef sandwich at the Erie County Fair in 1885 in Hamburg, New York. During the fair, they ran out of pork sausage for their sandwiches and substituted beef. Kuntzig, who spoke to Frank Menches, says they exhausted their supply of sausage, so purchased chopped up beef from a butcher, Andrew Klein. Historian Joseph Streamer wrote that the meat was from Stein's Market not Klein's despite Stein's having sold the market in 1874. The story notes that the name of the hamburger comes from Hamburg, New York not Hamburg, Germany. Frank Menches's obituary in the New York Times states that these events took place at the 1892 Summit County Fair in Akron, Ohio. Fletcher Davis of Athens Texas claimed to have invented the hamburger. According to oral histories, in the 1880s he opened a lunch counter in Athens and served a burger of fried ground beef patties with mustard and Bermuda onion between two slices of bread, with a pickle on the side. The story is that in 1904, Davis and his wife City ran a sandwich stand at the St. Louis World's Fair. Historian Frank X. Tolbert, noted that Athens resident Clint Murchison said his grandfather dated the hamburger to the 1880s with Old Dave a.k.a. Fletcher Davis. A photo of Old Dave's hamburger stand from 1904 was sent to Tolbert as evidence of the claim. Various nonspecific claims of invention relate to the term hamburger steak without mention of its being a sandwich. The first printed American menu which listed hamburger is said to be in 1834 menu from Delmonico's in New York. However, the printer of the original menu was not in business in 1834. In 1889, a menu from Walla Walla Union in Washington offered hamburger steak as a menu item. Between 1871 and 1884, Hamburg beef steak was on the breakfast and supper menu of the Clipper restaurant at 311-313 Pacific Street in San Fernando, California. It cost 10 cents the same price as mutton chops, pig's feet in batter, and stewed veal. It was not, however, on the dinner menu. Only pig's head, calf tongue, and stewed kidneys were listed. Another claim ties the hamburger to Summit County, New York, or Ohio. Summit County, Ohio exists, but Summit County, New York does not. Hamburgers are usually a feature of fast food restaurants. The hamburgers served in major fast food establishments are usually mass-produced in factories and frozen for delivery to the site. These hamburgers are thin and of uniform thickness, differing from the traditional American hamburger prepared in homes and conventional restaurants, which is thicker and prepared by hand from ground beef. Most American hamburgers are round, but some fast food chains, such as Wendy's, sell square-cut hamburgers. Hamburgers in fast food restaurants are usually grilled on a flat top, but some firms, such as Burger King, use a gas flame grilling process. At conventional American restaurants, hamburgers may be ordered rare, but normally are served medium well or well done for food safety reasons.
Fast food restaurants do not usually offer this option. The McDonald's fast food chain sells the Big Mac, one of the world's top selling hamburgers, with an estimated 550 million sold annually in the United States. Other major fast food chains, including Burger King, A&W, Culver's, Whataburger, Carl's Jr. Slash Hardee's Chain, Wendy's, Jack in the Box, Cookout, Harvey's, Shake Shack, In-N-Out Burger, Five Guys, Fat Burger, Vera's, Burgerville, Backyard Burgers, Licks Home Burger, Roy Rogers, Smash Burger and Sonic also rely heavily on hamburger sales. Fudrickers and Red Robin are hamburger chains that specialize in the mid-tier restaurant-style variety of hamburgers. Some restaurants offer elaborate hamburgers using expensive cuts of meat and various cheeses, toppings, and sauces. One example is the Bobby's Burger Palace chain founded by well-known chef and Food Network star Bobby Flay. Claims of Invention Louis Lassen Hamburgers are often served as a fast dinner, picnic, or party food and are often cooked outdoors on barbecue grills. Charlie Nagreen Otto Quays Oscar Weber Bilby Frank and Charles Menches Fletcher Davis a high-quality hamburger patty is made entirely of ground beef and seasonings, these may be described as all-beef hamburger or all-beef patties to distinguish them from inexpensive hamburgers made with cost savers like added flour, textured vegetable protein, ammonia-treated defatted beef trimmings, advanced meat recovery, or other fillers. In the 1930s ground liver was sometimes added. Some cooks prepare their patties with binders like eggs or breadcrumbs. Seasonings may include salt and pepper and others like as parsley, onions, soy sauce, Thousand Island dressing, onion soup mix, or Worcestershire sauce. Many name brand seasoned salt products are also used. Raw hamburger may contain harmful bacteria that can produce foodborne illness such as Escherichia coli O157H7, due to the occasional initial improper preparation of the meat, so caution is needed during handling and cooking. Because of the potential for foodborne illness, the USDA recommends hamburgers be cooked to an internal temperature of 160 degrees Fahrenheit. If cooked to this temperature, they are considered well done. Burgers can also be made with patties made from ingredients other than beef. For example, a turkey burger uses ground turkey meat, a chicken burger uses ground chicken meat. A buffalo burger uses ground meat from a bison, and an ostrich burger is made from ground seasoned ostrich meat. A deer burger uses ground venison from deer. Other hamburger steak claims A veggie burger, black bean burger, garden burger, or tofu burger uses a meat analog, a meat substitute such as tofu, TVP, seton, corn, beans, grains, or an assortment of vegetables, ground up and mashed into patties. In the United States and Canada, Burgers may be classified as two main types, fast food hamburgers and individually prepared burgers made in homes and restaurants. The latter are often prepared with a variety of toppings, including lettuce, tomato, onion, and often sliced pickles. French fries often accompany the burger. Cheese, either melted directly on the meat patty or crumbled on top is generally an option. Condiments might be added to a hamburger or may be offered separately on the side including mustard, mayonnaise, ketchup, salad dressings, and barbecue sauce. Other toppings can include bacon, avocado, or guacamole, 
sliced sautéed mushrooms, cheese sauce, chili, fried egg, scrambled egg, feta cheese, blue cheese, salsa, pineapple, jalapenos and other kinds of chili peppers, anchovies, slices of ham or bologna, pastrami or teriyaki seasoned beef, tartar sauce, french fries, onion rings or potato chips. In Mexico, burgers are served with ham and slices of American cheese fried on top of the meat patty. The toppings include avocado, jalapeno slices, shredded lettuce, onion and tomato. The bun has mayonnaise, ketchup and mustard. In certain parts are served with bacon, which can be fried or grilled along with the meat patty. A slice of pineapple is also a usual option, and the variation is known as a Hawaiian hamburger. Some restaurants' burgers also have barbecue sauce, and others also replace the ground patty with sirloin, al pastor meat, barbacoa, or a fried chicken breast. Many burger chains from the United States can be found all over Mexico, including Carl's Jr., Sonic, as well as global chains such as McDonald's and Burger King. Hamburgers in the UK and Ireland are very similar to those in the US, and the high street is dominated by the same big two chains as in the US McDonald's and Burger King. The menus offered to both countries are virtually identical, although portion sizes tend to be smaller in the UK. In Ireland the food outlet Supermax is widespread throughout the country serving burgers as part of its menu. In Ireland, a break Barbara and Eddie Rockets are also major chains. Early Major Vendors An original and indigenous rival to the big two US giants was the quintessentially British fast food chain Wimpy, originally known as Wimpy Bar which served its hamburgers on a plate with British-style chips, accompanied by cutlery and delivered to the customer's table. In the late 1970s, to compete with McDonald's, Wimpy began to open American-style counter-service restaurants and the brand disappeared from many UK high streets when those restaurants were rebranded as Burger Kings between 1989 and 1990 by the then owner of both brands. Grand Metropolitan. A management buyout in 1990 split the brands again and now wimpy table service restaurants can still be found in many town centers whilst new counter service wimpies are now often found at motorway service stations. Hamburgers are also available from mobile kiosks, commonly known as burger vans, particularly at outdoor events such as football matches. Burgers from this type of outlet are usually served without any form of salad only fried onions and a choice of tomato ketchup, mustard, or brown sauce. Today Chip shops, particularly in the West Midlands and northeast of England, Scotland, and Ireland, serve battered hamburgers called batter burgers. This is where the burger patty, by itself, is deep fat fried in batter and is usually served with chips. Hamburgers and veggie burgers served with chips and salad, are standard pub grub menu items. Many pubs specialize in gourmet burgers. These are usually high quality minced steak patties, topped with items such as blue cheese, brie, avocado etc. Some British pubs serve burger patties made from more exotic meats including venison burgers, bison burgers, ostrich burgers, and in some Australian-themed pubs even kangaroo burgers can be purchased. These burgers are served in a similar way to the traditional hamburger but are sometimes served with a different sauce including red currant sauce, mint sauce, and plum sauce. Safety Variations United States and Canada In the early 21st century premium hamburger chain and independent restaurants have arisen, 
selling burgers produced from meat stated to be of high quality and often organic, usually served to eat on the premises rather than to take away. Chains include Gourmet Burger Kitchen, Ultimate Burger, Hamburger Union, and Byron Hamburgers in London. Independent restaurants such as Meat Market and Dirty Burger developed a style of rich, juicy burger in 2012 which is known as a Dirty Burger or Third Wave Burger. In recent years Rustlers has sold pre-cooked hamburgers reheatable in a microwave oven in the United Kingdom. In the UK, as in North America and Japan, the term burger can refer simply to the patty, be it beef, some other kind of meat, or vegetarian. Fast food franchises sell American-style fast food hamburgers in Australia and New Zealand. The traditional Australasian hamburgers are usually bought from fish and chip shops or milk bars. The hamburger meat is almost always ground beef, or mince as it is more commonly referred to in Australia and New Zealand. They commonly include tomato, lettuce, grilled onion, and meat as minimum, and can optionally include cheese, beetroot, pineapple, a fried egg and bacon. If all these optional ingredients are included it is known in Australia as burger with the lot. The only variance between the two countries' hamburgers is that New Zealand's equivalent to the lot often contains a steak as well. The condiments regularly used are barbecue sauce and tomato sauce. The McDonald's McCown's burger is partway between American and Australian-style burgers, having beetroot and tomato in an otherwise typical American burger, however, it is no longer a part of the menu. Likewise, McDonald's in New Zealand created a kiwi burger, similar to a quarter pounder, but features salad, beetroot, and a fried egg. The Hungry Jack's Aussie burger has tomato, lettuce, onion, cheese, bacon, beetroot, egg, ketchup, and a meat patty. In China, restaurants such as McDonald's and KFC exist, which sell hamburgers. In Japan, hamburgers can be served in a bun, called hanbage, or just the patties served without a bun, known as hangu or hamburg, short for hamburg steak. Hamburg steaks are similar to what are known as Salisbury steaks in the U.S. They are made from minced beef, pork, or a blend of the two mixed with minced onions, egg, breadcrumbs and spices. They are served with brown sauce with vegetable or salad sides, or occasionally in Japanese curries. Hamburgers may be served in casual, western-style suburban restaurant chains known in Japan as family restaurants. Hamburgers in buns, on the other hand, are predominantly the domain of fast food chains such as American chains known as McDonald's and Wendy's. Japan has homegrown hamburger chain restaurants such as Moe's Burger, First Kitchen, and Freshness Burger. Local varieties of burgers served in Japan include teriyaki burgers, katsu burgers, and burgers containing shrimp korok. Some of the more unusual examples include the rice burger, where the bun is made of rice, and the luxury 1000 yen takumai burger, featuring avocados freshly grated wasabi, and other rare seasonal ingredients. In terms of the actual patty, there are burgers made with Kobe beef, butchered from cows that are fed with beer and massaged daily. McDonald's Japan also recently launched a McPork burger, made with U.S. pork. McDonald's has been gradually losing market share in Japan to these local hamburger chains due in part to the preference of Japanese diners for fresh ingredients and more refined, upscale hamburger offerings. Burger King once retreated from Japan, but re-entered the market in summer 2007 in cooperation with the Korean-owned Japanese fast food chain Lotteria. According to the Guinness World Records, 
a Japanese man, Takeru Kobayashi ate the most amount of hamburgers in three minutes on July 11, 2014. Rice burgers, mentioned above, are also available in several East Asian countries such as Taiwan and South Korea. Lotteria is a big hamburger franchise in Japan owned by the South Korean Lottie Group, with outlets also in China, South Korea, Vietnam, and Taiwan. In addition to selling beef hamburgers, they also have hamburgers made from squid, pork, tofu, and shrimp. Variations available in South Korea include bulgogi burgers and kimchi burgers. In the Philippines, a wide range of major U.S. fast food franchises are well represented, together with local imitators, often amended to the local palate. The chain McDonald's have a range of burger and chicken dishes often accompanied by plain steamed rice or French fries. The Philippines boasts its own burger chain called Jollibee, which offers burger meals and chicken, including a signature burger called Champ. Jollibee now has a number of outlets in the United States, the Middle East and East Asia. In India, burgers are usually made from chicken or vegetable patties due to cultural beliefs against eating beef and pork. Because of this, the majority of fast food chains and restaurants in India do not serve beef. McDonald's in India, for instance, does not serve beef, offering the Maharaja Mac instead of the Big Mac, substituting the beef patties with chicken. Another version of the Indian vegetarian burger is the Wada Pav consisting deep-fried potato patty dipped in gram flour batter. It is usually served with mint chutney and fried green chili. In Pakistan, apart from American fast food chains, burgers can be found in stalls near shopping areas, the best known being the Shami burger. This is made from Shami kebab, made by mixing lentil and minced lamb. Onions, scrambled egg, and ketchup are the most maybe toppings. In Malaysia there are 300 McDonald's restaurants. The menu in Malaysia also includes eggs and fried chicken on top of the regular burgers. Burgers are also easily found at nearby mobile kiosks, especially Ramli Burger. In Mongolia, a recent fast food craze due to the sudden influx of foreign influence has led to the prominence of the hamburger. Specialized fast food restaurants serving to Mongolian tastes have sprung up and seen great success. In Turkey, in addition to the internationally familiar offerings, numerous localized variants of the hamburger may be found, such as the Islak burger, which a beef slider doused in seasoned tomato sauce and steamed inside a special glass chamber and has its origins in the Turkish fast food retailer Kizil Kyler. Other variations include lamb burgers and offal burgers, which are offered by local fast food businesses and global chains alike, such as McDonald's and Burger King. Most burger shops have also adopted a pizzeria-like approach when it comes to home delivery, and almost all major fast food chains deliver. In the former Yugoslavia, and originally in Serbia, there is a local version of the hamburger known as the Plčeskovica. It is often served as a patty, but may have a bun as well. Throughout Belgium and in some eateries in the Netherlands, a Bicky burger is sold that combines pork, chicken, and horse meat. The hamburger, usually fried, is served between a bun sprinkled with sesame seeds. It often comes with a specific bicky sauce made with mayonnaise, mustard, cabbage, and onion. Mexico United Kingdom and Ireland Australia and New Zealand China Japan Other countries Unusual hamburgers 
slang.